So this evening I put Sonoma back on the treadmill for 10 minutes. My mom did it for 7 this morning, but I guess he kept jumping off. This time I was holding one of those Greenies dental chews in front of him, so he kept running towards it. And I didn't put all 10 minutes of him running on the treadmill because that's extremely boring. So I just put like a minute and then him getting off, but he did go longer for a minute. So, and now he's like exhausted on the floor, but I'm going to take him outside because he needs to be groomed. Even though he had the greenie, which is like for dental health and they're really yummy. He has to have his teeth brushed and he definitely needs to have his fur brushed. So I'm gonna bring him out on the deck and do that now while it's still light out. Okay, Sonoma, jump on. That's it, stay. Stay. Good boy. So, for his toothpaste, the kind I have is the brand Well and Good Natural Toothpaste for Dogs Peanut Butter Flavored. Um, I just wanted a peanut butter one because I didn't want his breath smelling like bacon even though he loves all those bacon chicken ones and one that was natural. So this sounds well and good to me. And in this water bottle, I have his toothbrush. And he's gonna sit up there very nicely and let me brush his teeth and then do his fur. Cause it's shedding season, so he's shedding more than normal. And I'm wearing this, like it's actually a beach cover up because, whoa, there goes the water bottle. Yikes. Because it gets fur everywhere. And all over my clothes, so I just throw this on and it's like my new grooming clothes. Okay, Sonoma. Good up. That's it, good boy. Stay. He always likes getting his right side done more than his left. I don't know why. Stay. Good boy, stay. I don't think your left side is as good. Why do you, you just like to chew on the right side of your mouth? head this way. Okay, I'm grabbing a little more toothpaste because there's a spot I want to get on him. Okay, stay. Turn this way, buddy. Nope, stay. There we go. I got it now. Those front teeth. Sonoma, watch me. Good boy, stay. Good boy. Alright, you do this side again. Or I'll do this side again. Yeah, hold your lip open. So, wait, wait, stay. Good boy. 
And then sometimes I just give him a tiny bit just because it gets on his teeth. And they said that the brushing motion isn't as important as the stuff just getting on his teeth. So he licks that, gets it all in his mouth. And now I will put, oops, upside down, this stuff away and grab his brush. For him, since he's a Lab Dane mix, I have the Furminator. It is expensive, it's like $40, but this thing is amazing and he needs it because he sheds. So, Sonoma, stand. Which way do you want to face? Face the camera. Stand this way. This way. No jump off. That's it. Good boy. Stay. Leave the plant. Or er, dirt, not plant. Good boy. So in like three swipes, I got this much fur off. It's crazy. I have no idea where we're going to groom him when it's winter and it's freezing out and I can't do it here out on the deck because we can't have fur flying around in the house. But luckily we have a while until fall and winter. Okay, you can sit for this part. Once I do your tail, you're gonna have to stand up. And I'm just letting the fur go into the yard. That's the grooming bag, just went for lion. All right, let me get your head, or your neck really, not your head. Good boy, Sonoma. Okay, Sonoma, stand. Nope, just stand. That's it, stay. I got it. Nope, leave that. You can't have, leave the dirt, leave it. Turn around, I'll help you. Ready? That's it, now I gotta get this side. Boy, it's a very small area for him to turn around on, so even though he's almost 80 pounds, luckily I can lift him to maneuver him like that or I could have just had him jump down and jump back up but he's fine and since he's so used to being handled it doesn't bother him if I pick him up or touch him at all during these things look at all this right at the base of your tail I know it tickles but you gotta stand now I'm gonna stand. Nope, this way. Stand. That's it. Stay. Good boy. Gotta get your right side. I did your left. This little bottom. much fur is in this thing. Good boy, you stay. so it sheds out here in the yard instead of in the house. So there 
very carefully under his neck. Mostly his whole back, all the way down to that tail. Oh, and you went right to grab your ball. Yep. And now he wants to play again. Don't want to do too much because I don't want you to get splinters out here. So let's do more catch. Catch is easier. Good boy. Drop it. Come on. If you want to play, you got to drop it. What are you doing? Nope, don't chew it. Drop it. That's it. Catch! Drop it. Yes, catch! There we go, buddy. Drop it. Catch! Whoa! You are so tall. If you have more energy tonight, we're going to do this in the basement. Oh! thought that was going to fall outside the deck. Because then it's carpeted. And I'm sitting on one of his beds out here. Oh, I didn't put his fermenter away. It's starting to get cold out. It's like nice, it's beautiful out, but I'm in like pajamas. Well, I'm in a bathing suit cover up for grooming. Good one. And like spring pajamas and it's windy and cool. Whoa, get it, boy. Figure it out, Cassidy. There you go. Okay, let's do three more. Gonna catch three. One, good boy, drop it. Two, good boy, drop it. Three, oh, we gotta do three more. Get it, get it, get it. Okay, you're lucky we get three more. We gotta do three in a row. One, oh, Sonoma, go get it. Okay, hold on, I'm fixing the phone. One. Oh my goodness, now you're just not catching them so we can play longer. One. Yes, drop it. Get it. Drop it. Two. Good boy, drop it. Whoops, now I dropped it. Three. Yes, good boy, drop it. All done. We're gonna go inside and get you a drink. So. For Sonoma, it is dinner time. It varies every night, but it is seven, and that's a good time for him. Oh, Sonoma, I'm, I'm off track. Come over here. Sit. Sit. Stay. You have to be sitting and staying. So, we keep water in his dish. When we give him his food, you stay. Good boy, because for labs and Danes apparently, probably other breeds, stay, good boy. They eat, whoa, <laughs> I almost just fell over, very, very fast. So this is the kind of food he has. It's Nutrisource, it's for big, large dogs, and it's grain free. And it's chicken and pea. So this is one cup. And it's going right into the water. So it's like he has chicken and pea soup every night. I'm getting him one. And like a little bit more. And I might play with him in the basement again. But not until an hour after he eats. So he digests. So his food and his treats are in there. Good boy, you stay. No, stay, leave it. I know, it just looks so delicious. Leave it. 
stay. Sonoma, watch me. That's it, watch me. Hey, watch me. Yes. Okay, eat dinner. So the water helps him slow down and not completely like chow down his food even though he does but it's also nice because then he gets food and water at the same time so he's definitely hydrated in the morning and at night because he has water with both of his meals and he eats twice a day and the food is adjusted based on if I give him some kind of treat like the dental chew he got after doing the treadmill today.